Tonight is a unique, one-of-a-kind evening for these women. They will never again have exactly this experience. I think that what brings us really close together is the fact that we are all very bubbly and we love to laugh, so we do anything we can to make each other laugh. I hear you also are a karate expert or close to it. Do, do, do you have a belt? Forgive my naivete. Do you have a belt? I am a black belt and I am the unofficial official bodyguard for the court. <laughs> very good. Um, I think that we all have very different personalities, but we all mesh well. We all respect each other's opinions and we all just have a great time and we're all willing to compromise, but we're all compassionate. So. Well, I want to be a lawyer because I think being part of the law and being able to fight for something I believe in and be the voice for people who don't always have one is just a powerful and honorable like job. Um, I think that the girls are naturally outgoing, so that helps a lot too. The Ambassador Youth Program is what you're involved in. Tell us a bit of, the, of that if you can. So it's basically a large group of students who go out and serve the community, whether it's by tutoring young children, um, feeding the less unfortunate, cleaning up, or setting up for events. It's not just um, uh, you know, a, particular, a particular group. It's, it's open to all the girls that are interested in, in self-confidence and being role models. Um, I, we're very proud, number one, that um, she chose to do this. It was an, an experience that I think all girls should go through so they can open up their, their um, horizons to different things that are available to them in the community and, and just in general um, to meet other, other girls that are inspired. Every year we're honored to host hundreds of young applicants who aspire to be members of the Royal Court. The wide variety of gifts and talents, the selection process is not easy for the Queen and the Court Committee. The seven unique ladies we have here tonight exhibited their own special talents and spirit recognized by the committee. They have already come together as a team and formed bonds that will take them on an adventure representing the Tournament of Roses over 100 appearances, including the 102nd Rose Bowl game and 127th Rose Parade. The 2016 Rose Queen is Erica Karen Winter. This experience in itself is probably the biggest adventure I've ever been on in my entire life. Uh, just the tryout process is an adventure where you're going in and meeting these 11 judges that you've never seen before and they're asking you questions that you didn't know and so you're kind of thinking on your feet and just showing your public speaking abilities and your confidence and that's, that's been my adventure so far. Queen Erica is president of the 127th Tournament of Roses. It is my privilege and honor to crown you as the Rose Queen for the coming year. Congratulations. Well, I, I, I'm proud of my daughter for being who she is and not trying to be something she's not. And um, I'm, I'm proud of my wife. It's cute because my daughter has said that um, her mother is her role model. And uh, I couldn't be more proud of, of, of that. Queen Erica, I now officially proclaim you the 98th Rose Queen. There they are. It's picture, it's picture taken time. We'll see you all on New Year's Day at the 127th Rose Parade and the 102nd Rose Bowl game. Thank you all.